To calculate the formal charges for CO, carbon monoxide, let's start with the carbon atom here. So for carbon, we have four valence electrons. It's in group 14, sometimes called 4A, and it has four valence electrons. We'll subtract the unbonded valence electrons. That's these electrons right here. They're not bonded to anything. They're not between atoms. We have two of those, and then we'll minus half of the bonded electrons. These are the ones here involved in the chemical bond between the carbon and the oxygen. We have two, four, six of those. Four minus two is two. Two minus three, that'll give us a negative one formal charge, and we'll put that right here on the carbon. For the oxygen, we will have six valence electrons. Subtract the unbonded electrons, two, and then we're going to subtract one half of the bonded valence electrons, which is two, four, six. So six over two. Six minus two is four. Four minus three is plus one. So we'll put these formal charges up here for oxygen. And those are the formal charges for CO. We'd like them to be closer to zero if possible. There really isn't another way to write this Lewis structure where we use all 10 of the valence electrons and complete the octets for carbon and oxygen. So this is the best we can do. And these are the formal charges on carbon and oxygen in the carbon monoxide molecule. This is Dr. B and thanks for watching.